Hello everyone, I hope you're doing very well. A very quick video to show, as many of you have requested, how do you put an English cockpit in a native airframe, like a Mirage, like a, I don't know, L39, uh, a cockpit that doesn't have uh, English markings, but it's very easy to do it for all of the aircraft that it can be done on from your main menu here. You just click on options here then over to special and uh, there's as well as in changing to english cockpits there's a lot of other cool stuff in special so always make sure you check it out when you get a new aircraft and select the choice uh, the aircraft of interest so the mirage we're going to do now and customize cockpit if you leave it on default it's the native you know it's the french and we're going to change it english okay to save and that's it you're in english cockpit from then on um, now some of the aircraft have this some of them don't so let's try and find one that doesn't let's see if an oh, a KF50 can do it. Uh, yep, see, you can have an English cockpit and a KF50. Let's have a look at a plane that doesn't have it. An SU25. Oh, well, it does have it. No, it doesn't have it, you see. So, to find out which plane does have the ability to have an English cockpit, just click on it in here and look at the customized cockpit. And that's it. And just don't forget that there's other cool stuff in here. Um, uh, why don't I go to where's that Mirage again? If I can find him, uh, ping. Uh, so things like um, you can disable, I don't know why you have a word, but you could disable the gyro drift, drift if you're going on a long mission I didn't want to um, realign your gyro and you can turn off the need for uh, aligning the INS at the, on, on, on a cold start and whatnot. So there's cool stuff and it varies between each different aircraft what you can set. Right, that's what you wanted, hope that helps and see you later.